it's just really cool that no matter where in the globe you are, you can, you can grant wishes from anywhere on the planet. And it's, um, it's something that I'll bend my schedule around. I'll make time for the wish and then do everything else later because whatever it is, it's, it's not as important as you know, making a child or a family's experience. And uh, it's, it's just been a great thing. Like, uh, not only do I want to make the families proud and make them excited about WWE, but I coordinate with, uh, with our representatives in the WWE, with the Make-A-Wish Foundation, about how we can possibly make their experience even better. And since 2004, it's now 2012, like I said, I think we have a, a great system in the WWE, and I think every family that gets a chance to have a wish, it exceeds expectations. Uh, because WWE travels constantly, uh, the WISH children, the WISH families come to our events. Uh, they meet me in person or the person they'd like to meet before the event. They get a bunch of one-on-one -on -one time. They get to ask all their questions. We get to hang out together. Um, when it comes to me, I make sure they have all the latest John Cena stuff, shirt, hat, wristbands, program, whatever we have available that night, they have for the show. So they are completely decked out as far as it goes, you know, as WWE is concerned. And that's not really where it ends. We usually send them right into the building, and it's right usually at the start of our program. They become my special guest for Raw. They sit. I, I know exactly where they're sitting. And a lot of times on Raw, people ask me, like, what am I saying when I'm talking trash or pointing to people? I'm usually saying hello to a Make-A-Wish kid. So I make sure to make it really their day, their experience. And it, it really is cool that they can meet someone and then really be part of the action as well. I, I treat these, these Wish kids, their families, like super fans, they are. They're, they're, they're very important guests of the WWE. And I want to make sure their experience from the second they walk in to a WWE arena to the second they leave is the best that they've ever had. And that's essentially what Make-A-Wish is all about. Granting that one thing that a child really wants to do and hoping that the one thing you know, reaches or exceeds expectations. So for me, I always want to make sure that the WWE ex experience exceeds expectations.